Hey everybody, welcome back to the Coin Pusher. Today we're doing a one quarter challenge. We paid one million dollars for that quarter. And we just put it in there and it didn't do nothing. Maybe we'll get a second wave here. Oh, sweet. Nice. Oh, check that out. Even pushed over a tower, two towers. Sweet. All right, well, let's keep it going. We got a decent amount of quarters back. That, oh, those $5,000 chips are still raining into the pay. All right. Quit dropping quarters everywhere, it'd be doing a lot better, huh? Yeah, I got a. Well, we've done knocked over two towers. There's two more over on the left side. There's some golden towers, a little tiny towers. There's a couple of mystery bags. They got the big old leaning tower or pizza looking thing. It's a humongous tower. It's leaning pretty bad though. Moving towards that shelf. I'm not sure if you can tell off camera, but it's definitely leaning. There's uh, six towers made out of $25,000 chips on the red shelves, along with two ginormous mystery bags. Wish me luck, and hopefully we'll win a whole bunch of this. Tell you what, we're getting paid out pretty well in $5,000 chips. Wow, I just realized that all kinds of $10,000 chips falling out of the base of that great big tower. That's a really good sign that it isn't going to hold on too much longer. able to get another one of those five thousand dollar towers to fall kind of feel like we should put the quarters on the center and the left since uh, the tower is kind of leaning towards the right so there's probably a lot less weight on the base of the, of the left side so we probably could chip away at the base of it at the left Then we'll give it a little push on the right, and it'll probably topple over. Hopefully. Golden towers are on the edge. Quite a bit of gold there. Oh yeah, I stopped and grabbed all the quarters, sorted everything out. Doing pretty good. We've done pulled a little over 200 grand. So, you know, two tenths of the way there from breaking even. Check it out, all those $10,000 chips. There's a whole bunch of them about to go. Oh my, Denver! Oh sweet, it knocked over the golden tower as well. Wow. <laughs> nice, I did not expect it to, to fall like that. We got pretty lucky. We didn't lose any of it to the red shell. Well, we could probably push across the whole field now, huh? Wow. We're in the movie. We're in the movie. Oh, nice. Another golden tower. It's raining. $10,000 chips and $5,000 chips. Quite a bit on them red shelves. That'll cost us, uh, what, $2 million if we want to get this stuff off the red shelves. We could go get a reset chip out of our lockbox, but I'd like to save them for more expensive games. The green earbuds. Wow, I 
just realized this tower is still standing. Oh my goodness. It's touching the glass up here though. You can see where it's uh, bending that over. Bending that tower right over up there at the top. That would be a nice push. Wow, the center just moved on up a bunch right there. Oh yeah, and then it paid out massively. I would love to get that tower knocked over on that left side. At least let's get as many of these $10,000 chips out of here as possible. Oh yeah, raining $10,000 chips. Nice. They're doing really, really well. Gun pulled. Three, four, five. Around $6 million in total. Which is really good. That's six times our money already. But we're getting ready to go pay two million dollars more so we can get all this stuff here on the shelves. I think it'll be worth it though. Those mystery bags are looking pretty full. Probably got some really valuable stuff in them. These one quarter challenges really Turn a huge profit. So a lot of risk involved on a one quarter challenge in a, in a high limit coin pusher. You lose it all just to drop a one quarter. I kind of feel like it's uh, pushed about as good as it's going to push. Let's uh, go ahead and pay the $2 million, get the machine reset. Boy, oh boy, that is a ginormous tower, is it not? A $25,000 tower, that's a multi-million dollar tower for sure. Goodness. Oh, they took the uh, half of that tower that was over here on the left side, they stuck it on top of the big old $25,000 chip tower. Is that showing up on camera? Yeah, barely. It's a really tall tower. Hopefully we don't lose too much to the red shelves. Hopefully we don't lose anything to the red shelves, that would be ideal. We'll see how it goes. The Marcus Tower is moving forward pretty good. Ooh, the mystery mags are doing pretty well also. Oh yeah, look at that tower. It's moving on on up real quick like. It won't be long, it'll be flying across the screen. It'll be $25,000 chips and $5,000 chips just everywhere. Hopefully it'll knock this tower over here. Over. We'll see. It keeps on getting further and further towards that right corner. It's going to make it more difficult for us. Nice, we just got the mystery bag. Oh, we better actually pull it out of there. Since this tower is about to go, I'm pretty certain of it anyways. As soon as it goes, we're gonna go hard on the right side. Because there'll probably be some weight in the center. To be our opportunity to push on the right, get that little tower going. be our only chance to get in it. Oh, 
Oh, sweet air wet. Wow. So we're gonna stay on the right for a moment. And obviously the center will push anyhow, because I just can't get the quarters to uh, stay on the on that very, very far right. They, they kind of go wherever you, they want to go. But I can kind of pick between right and center or left and center for the most part. If I dropped them one at a time, they'd probably do better. Let's see how, let's see how far I can move it. To the right. Yeah, that's about it. Put them in one at a time. That's about as far as it goes over. Now I could uh, give it a little twist to the wrist and get it further. Anyway, let's keep it going. We don't need to undo. This is prime time to be uh, pushing on that right corner. We don't want to mess it up. Oh yeah, it's working. We're getting paid out massively on $25,000 chips. In fact, it's just overfilled. All right. That's why I pulled that mystery bag out of there, hoping it wouldn't overfill like that. But we did it anyways. Marvelous pushing going on, but I'm out of quarters. I gotta grab some more. Let's check it out and see what's in this mystery bag. Oh, sweet. Check this out. I'm not sure why they got a thousand dollar chip in there. But they got what? Three of the white dice, three of the golden dice. Oh, this might be the 500 slash 1000. Oh, it is. Nice. Sweet. We've been looking for one of those for a long time and we got it. I almost passed it up. It's been so long since we have seen one. Oh my goodness. That right there is extremely valuable. Uh, it's essentially, it's a coupon chip. It gets you in on any game you want for only $500. Doesn't matter how much the price is, turn that in. You get in for 500 bucks. It's amazing. So we'll find a real good game in some time, hopefully soon, to uh, turn that in on. So if you're wanting to see that, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. That way you get notified when we upload new videos. I'll probably title it something like, uh, you know, whatever price it was, and then it'll be like marked down to $500 or discounted to $500, something like that. Like I said, it could be any time between now and the next few weeks. This kind of depends on when a good game comes across. A really expensive game. I should say, not necessarily a good one, but a really expensive one. Because uh, I don't see the point in turning it in on a real cheap game. We might as well get the biggest thing for a buck, you know. It'd be nice if this mystery bag would go. I'm kind of curious to see what's in there. Uh, that's pretty nice. We got, what was it, three white dice and three golden dice as well. The uh, white dice and the golden dice are multipliers. And right later on, we're going to roll them. The white dice are going to multiply the poker chips, and the golden dice are going to multiply the gold. Now, we got a decent amount of gold in this game. I'm thinking it was like around the 20 ounces of gold mark, somewhere around there. I'll tally it all up officially at the end. Oh my, that mystery bag is looking ready to go. That tower on the right is looking like it's about to go as well. Oh my, that mystery bag is definitely thinking about going. Oh yeah, there it went, finally. Uh, let me grab the quarters and then uh, we'll check that mystery bag out. All right, let's check out this mystery bag. Oh sweet, is that it? Not that I'm complaining, but two of the white dice and one of the golden dice. Sweet. It's pretty good, technically, for a $1 million buy-in. We, uh, oh goodness, I forgot how much we've done pulled out of here. We've got quite a bit, though. 
Alright, we're gonna make a big fortune on this and pretty certain of it. Jackpot win indeed. Let's get that right corner moving. Try mate, loading it up real thick like. Oh yeah, it's already working. Come on. Go for a mega push. Oh yeah, it's working. I think we're the last of the quarters though. We're going through quarters quick. Oh, nice. It's definitely working now. Keep her going. We've got a couple of nice pushes there. It's a big tsunami of quarters all about right here. There was a little bit of tsunami over here. I think that's what got that moving. Nice, move some more. Oh, it's touching the wall over there. Wow, we burned through all the quarters on this. There's no poker chips in that, so I didn't have to sort nothing out. Just grab the quarters and go. That's how our, it's, touching, it's touching the glass and the wall. That's not good. Oh my. Thinking about falling forward though, isn't it? See if I can move that camera. We're running pretty low on quarters. We should be getting more back here soon though. There is a huge tsunami of quarters right here. I don't know if you can tell. It picks it up on camera or not, but there is a huge stack of quarters right there. Stuck big time. That's a stubborn tower, I tell you what. Oh, sweet. Did you see it move? I did. The base of it moved just a little bit. Wasn't much. It all adds up though. A little bitty move here and a little bitty move there. some more. All right, let's keep her going. I'm hoping it's time for that tower to go. Oh yeah, did you see it move? I hope you can see that. We are making progress on that tower. Come on, big push.
Blow the rib real thick again. Gotta try something. Alright, that was all the quarters though. That's the thing about it though, you use them up real quick. We got nothing else to use them for though, right now. That's the objective, is to get as much out of here as we can by using them quarters. So let's use them. Oh, sweet, it went. Nice. Let's grab the quarters. Awesome. All right, let's get the last of it out of there. There's what, 15 grand? It's a little bit stuck way down here, but it'll go, and if it don't, they'll give that to us anyways. Oh yeah, it's sliding on down. I knew we could get it. I knew we could do it. Just had to be persistent about it. That was a super stubborn tire, though. You can do it. Come on, can I push you. Oh, nice. We got it. Sweet. All right, let me call him back here. Have him place those dice in there. All righty, let's keep her going. We got them dice in there. Let's uh, push them on down to that lower shelf. Hopefully they'll land on some really nice numbers. Well, I pushed out uh, uh, quite a bit of these and then I uh, just asked them to go ahead and remove a, a bunch of the excess. It doesn't do us any good, I don't think, to have all the extra quarters in there. So The gold is doing really good. We got a four and another four and a six. We just got a four on the white dice as well. Wow. Let's see what else. Oh, a two and a three. So we got a two and a three and a four on the white dice. He's got a one on the golden dice. So ones do not count. Got be two or better. Oh, we got a two and a six on the white dice. Wow. All right. Well, let me tally it all together. We'll multiply it by that right there, and we'll be right back. So together we pulled $13,495,000 out of there and them white dice totaled up to 17, turned it into an astounding $229,415,000. We also pulled 20 ounces of gold out of there and them golden dice totaled up to 14, turned it into 280 ounces of gold. And I'm not exactly sure what gold is today. I think it's like two thousand three. We'll go two thousand three hundred dollars. Turned it into six hundred and forty-four thousand dollars worth of gold. All in all, that is incredible for a three point one million dollar buy-in. Absolutely incredible. Well, if y'all enjoy the videos, do me a favor, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and we'll see you on the next one. Hey, y'all take care.